So today I want to talk a little bit about 5D consciousness. Yeah. Here's why I want to talk about it because I saw a video yesterday morning while I was just scrolling through that brought up an amazing, amazing point. And it has been on my mind ever fucking since. So here's what this lady said. She said that all of those people out there that are saying, oh, I am done with all the drama. I can't do all the drama. And they've gone really quiet no matter what realm you're in. Okay, mainly spiritual because that's we talk about all the 5D shit. But she said those of you guys that are completely stepping away from the drama and checking out and saying, well, I'm entering 5D consciousness. So I don't have time for that low vibe shit anymore are actually not entering 5D consciousness. They're just actively masking all of that. Like she made it in a better, more eloquent way, point, whatever, than I am right now. But basically, she was saying that if you're stepping away from the drama, you're not doing anything about it, and you're not doing anything to make the world a better place, you are not 5D consciousness. You are still 3D. You're just putting a wall up and ignoring shit. So that got me really thinking, like, that makes a lot of fucking sense if you think about it. And it's been so long since I looked at 5D consciousness and stuff like that because, like, to be honest, I, I don't have time. Like, I have too much other shit to do. I don't have time right now. But I thought, you know what? This is bothering you so much, so let's talk about it. Let's look at it. Look at it. Look at it. Look about it. Whatever. So, first of all, just a quick Google search. Oh, my God. Y'all, it's going to hurt your brain just looking at all the shit that you find in the Google thing. But this one right here, this wiki expert one, is probably one of the better ones I read. Now, the little byline thingy, not byline, but the why is it so important, blah, 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 ignore that. Because this article is all about what is 5D consciousness and how you know if you are actively shifting to it or not. The article is fantastic. Please go read it. The one, the one paragraph that got me the most is this one right here. And while this has nothing to do with better or worse, because each soul is on the perfect path for them, those that are on the front lines of the ascension process, ascending from third dimensional reality to fifth dimensional reality, can often feel disheartened or lonely or even seek a world reflecting back to them so much pain and suffering. See, not seek. So that got me to thinking this too. Like people are talking about the shift from 3D to 5D, but they're not talking about the 4D. So first of all, I want you to pause real quick, read the 3D, and then read the 4D. I feel like she was right but wrong at the same time. She was right that those people are not ascending to 5D. However, I don't think that they are staying in the 3D. I think that they're in the 4D. Read that. Read it. Read that right there keen to dualistic forces. In other words, things that are very polarizing, good versus evil, light versus dark. That's 4D, not 5, 4. Now I want you to read that really carefully, but look at that last sentence. Understands that light and dark forces are two sides of the same coin. But that's just, you know, one little image. So what else? Because that makes a really good point. I gotta put my glasses on for this one because it's it's blurry as fuck even without glasses. So I want you to look at the things right here with the 4D and look right here. Comparison, duality still. Now the other things right there, yes, those are all ascending consciousness. But that one right there talks about the same thing that I just talked about. Look at the one for 5D right there. Awareness of connection is in 4D but authenticity is 5D. I, I want to know what you guys think about this. I want to know what you think of that point. And if I can find that lady's video, I'm sure I liked it, then I will, I will tag it in the comments because it was really good and it's made me think for shit over 24 hours now about what she said. What do you guys think though? Do you guys think that all of these people that are just saying, you know what, I'm not involved in the drama anymore, but still are keeping it going or still are watching it and still are believing that there is a good versus evil going on are ascending to 5D? Or do you think that they may be in 4D, that they're not all the way to 5D? They say they are, but they're not. And how many spiritual people do you know on here? And please don't name names because that's not what I'm asking for. I just want you to think how many spiritual 
people do you see on social media who are fake as fuck? Again, I don't want names. I don't care. I just want you to think. Seriously, I want to know what you think about it. I've been rolling it around in my brain since yesterday morning. And I wanted to bring it to y'all. Do you think that they are sliding way back into the beginning of 3D? Do you think that they're 4D? Or do you think that they are actually 5D, even with all of the things that I just pointed out to you? And if you start Googling 5D consciousness and 3D to 4D to 5D, you're going to see all of those things, all of those traits, all of those things, things. I'm just going to say things repeatedly. This kind of has my brain hurting. Like, I know what my mind says. My mind says that they're probably shifting to 4D or they are staying in 3D, but they are absolutely not 5D. Like everything I know about 5D, they're not 5D. So I do agree with her there. What do you guys think?